Hello, 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 YouTube. You're uh, with Tony on another edition of Tony's Topics. Kind of had something on my mind today. Been thinking about it off and on over the past couple of days, and I wanted to run it by you guys. It's this opportunity that Amazon brought along last year. As you know, uh, you might know that I pull some of Amazon's uh, trailers. Uh, with my authority. Um, been working with them quite a bit recently. I'm doing something a little different for the next few weeks. And I'll go back to Amazon. But anyway, this opportunity they have is they want to get into the home delivery market. So they want to be like UPS and FedEx and, you know, deliver straight to your home. You know, right now they're spending uh, billions, millions if not billions of dollars to uh, FedEx uh, UPS and um, other uh, carriers and people who deliver to to deliver their packages and they're wanting to uh, put some of that back in their own pocket well what they've decided to do is to give the everyday Joe Blow like you and me an opportunity to go into partnership with them not invest in with them but to go into partnership with them they're looking for some people with uh, a $10,000 investment, which is pretty cheap, uh, to earn up to, well, to be honest, that $10,000 is, is probably a, a, a bottom line $70,000 a year income. Um, but that $10,000 what it does is it, as I understand it, is it gets you equipment-wise into your first five trucks, and then it gets you set up with uniforms and their scanners, their technology, and so forth. Uh, whatever you need to get out on the road and get those first five vans rolling. And I guess they have a partnership uh, with the manufacturers where people can lease the vans uh, fairly, I'm not going to say inexpensively, but evidently you wouldn't find the deal anywhere else, okay? So $10,000, they want you to have thirty in the bank, uh, just 30000 so that you can live for two to three, four months, whatever, while your business gets off the ground. So you give them 10 grand, you get set up, you get rolling. Now here's the thing. In week five, they want you to add another five, five vans? I believe it's five vans. Week nine, another five. So now you're up to 15. And then week 11, they want you to add another five. So now you're up to 20 vans in 11 weeks. 20 vans. 20 employees and honestly you're probably going to have close to between 30 and 40 employees because the vans are going to run more than just one shift um, and all of a sudden you've gone from zero to you know supersonic in 11 weeks evidently they want the owner of the and that they're franchises okay they want the owner of the franchise to be there in the morning to give a hoorah, you know, motivational speech to the crew and help load up the vans. And they want you there in the evenings when they arrive. Hey, how'd it go? What were the problems? For $70,000 a year on... Um, $3 million income. I believe is what that what it was. I'm going to find the link to their brochure. And this brochure spells all of this out. And what they want you to do is get up to 40 trucks. Okay. I mean, it sounds like blood money to me. Because I'm sitting here thinking... One big semi truck, power only, 
no trailer, running Amazon trailers with a driver in it, paying a driver, I'm, I'm clearing 1500 a week, $2,000 a week, let's just say $1,500. I'm clearing $1,500 a week anyway, just with one truck. And I'm doing nothing. I have a driver driving the truck. I'm dispatching them. I don't know. I don't know. I mean, I don't know what other kind of a business you can get into that's that extravagant for $10,000. So, you know, good for Amazon for figuring that part out. But I tell you what, the profit margin there just doesn't make sense and now I stole this next comment from another person on YouTube who talks about this same thing and he talked about and I'm sorry I don't remember his name but he talked about profit per truck and so he was saying that <clears throat> even if you have 40 trucks and you make three hundred thousand dollars bottom line off of that was crazy eight or nine million dollars or something even if you make three hundred thousand dollars a year in your bank after all your expenses with 40 trucks or 40 vans excuse me that only comes to seventy five hundred dollars or so profit per van per year so like he said what about breakdowns and stuff I don't know, you know, I was really considering it because I like to work hard, I'm a hard worker. I don't know, I kind of like the idea of growing, but I don't know, I see a lot of red flags on that. Is anybody out there doing it? Is anybody a DSP? Amazon calls them DSPs, Delivery Service Partners. Are you a DSP, a franchise owner, or do you work for or know somebody who works for a DSP running Amazon packages out of the um, out of the Amazon vans. I'd love to know. I'd love to know. Uh, shoot me an email at Tony at EncoreTrucks.com or um, leave a comment down below. I'd like to see who's. I can't find any anything online. Uh, you know, praising this program. And the funny thing is, I still like the idea of it though. <laughs> Let me know. Until next time, have a great evening. Hey, don't forget to hit the like button. S subscribe if you want. Thanks, guys. Talk to you soon. Bye.